It's one of the most exciting research studies I've ever seen. The STAR-D research um, project from the National Institute of Mental Health took a wide range, up to 4,000 people with depression, and said, why is the treatment not working? We know these drugs work, but why are only 30% of people, when they're initially giving a, given a drug, why are they the only ones that are having a significant relief from medication? So they took those 30% out, and they took people who did not have relief with their first drug, okay? They took these people and they said, what if it's the wrong dose? So the first thing they did in this treatment was way up the dose of these antidepressants. And you've got 30% right there, right there off the top, better response. So there was the first problem. The second one was, maybe this drug is, alone is not enough. Let's put another drug with it. So let's put two drugs together. And so they would add, for example, a drug that works on serotonin with a drug that works on norepinephrine, two types of the hormones, I should say, neurotransmitters in our bodies that respond to drugs, put them together, and then they got another group of people who responded extremely well. Then there's the group, if that didn't work for them, where they actually switched to antidepressants. So one form didn't work for them. And a lot of people quit at that point, right? I've gotten this drug, it's no good, what's the point? And so they're gone. Instead, what the researchers found is switch to another drug. Switch to one that fits more of your profile. And right again, they had a huge response to that. So it has been a real seminal study to show that your doctor must understand the steps it takes to get you the right drug and the fact that it could take a very long time. And then in one of the final stages of the study, and they're still waiting for a lot of data, is to add psychotherapy and other non-traditional drugs to the study. And psychotherapy makes a huge difference in the treatment of depression, especially if you get a, draw, a drug that takes away a lot of your symptoms. So the STAR-D gives hope to people that they can find the right medication and truly alleviate a lot, if not most, of their depression symptoms.